All right, so the A's called up another pretty respected prospect today. This time it was pitcher Ken Waldachuk, a guy that, of course, we acquired in the Frankie Montas Lou Trevino trade. Um, he was a Yankee, of course, traded to the A's about a month ago and has spent time in the AAA system for the A's on the Aviators. And, you know, I think this is pretty exciting. Of course, when the A's traded uh, Montas and Trevino to the Yankees, I thought, you know, Waldachuk is the best prospect we're getting in return. And I still think right now, you know, you could make a case for J.P. Sears. Obviously, there's other guys in that trade that, you know, haven't even seen the big league level yet. Uh, but I think Waldachuk is very highly respected. Um, he was one of our top prospects after being added to the system. And um, I'm, you know, very happy that they're going to do this. He's going to make his debut very soon. Um, uh, rosters will expand on September 1st. And so, you know, obviously he's going to get a start um, very soon, probably in this series. And so... Yeah, Waldachuk, you know, has been a pretty highly respected prospect. He went to St. Mary's College, drafted it in 2019 out of the fifth round. Um, St. Mary's College is right near Oakland, and he, you know, obviously the A's had their eye on him, um, and he's been very good in the minor league level. Um, I think the main statistic to look at is his strikeout rate. Obviously, he struck out like seven uh, consecutive batters uh, with the Aviators, and, you know, that was something that I even saw just headline. It was a very good outing for him. That was recent, and I think that ultimately led to his call-up. He struck out total um, with the Aviators, 21 batters in just 18.2 innings. That's pretty good. Four starts uh, with the Aviators, AAA team. He has a 3.38 ERA with them and a 1.23 whip. I mean, you know, the stats aren't like, you know, Cy Young stats, but they're still very good for a guy like that. I think the A's are trying to sort of bolster their pitching staff right now. We've seen really good starts from Adrian Martinez and Adam Aller recently. And to add a guy like Waldachuk, and then also J.P. Sears, of course, the guy that was in this trade, it's looking good. And of course, we can move around guys to the bullpen and whatnot. And so I think Waldachuk, you know, with just about, you know, a little over a month left in the season, is probably going to get, you know, a chance here. And of course, want a even bigger role with the team in 2023. And so, yeah, I'm really happy about this. Like I said, his debut is coming soon. We're expecting it to be Thursday. Uh, and so that should be really exciting. Yeah, Waldachuk, I mean, he was a guy that came to the A system, immediately was ranked highly. Uh, he was, um, you know, by some reports, the best prospect in the uh, organization, you know, of course, following Langolier's promotion to uh, the big league level and um, considered even like the 35th best prospect in MLB. Uh, so I think the A's are sort of um, thinking, you know, this is a guy that we could just use right now. We're not making the playoffs. And Waldachuk has been really strong. He was strong with the Yankees. The Yankees needed to trade somebody pretty good for Frankie Montas and Lou Trevino. And it's already looking like a good trade for us with J.P. Sears and now Ken Waldachuk coming up. We'll see how he does in his debut. And following that, he'll probably get a you know a couple good starts if they don't send him back down. But, um, you know, I'm happy about this move. So let me know your guys' thoughts on this. Waldachuk is at the big league level. I'll see you guys later. And yeah, go A's.